<laughs> What's up guys, it's Nick. Um, so last week I weighed in at 215, all right? Uh, I get on the scale this morning and mind you, I told you I wanted to lose a pound a week. So my goal is like, all right, I at least gotta be 214, you know, lose one pound. I was like, all right, if I get on the scale and that something crazy happens, I'm gonna be like weighing 213, you know, like that's nuts. All right, that's like crazy talk. But yeah, hope, man, yeah, I just really hope, uh, you know, the dial went really well for me this week. I was like, man, I think, I just hope it's 214, you know, I hope I'm making progress. And I get on the scale and I'm 207.4. I'm like, holy cow, you know, like, I, I thought, like, for a second, it was, like, 217. I'm like, wait a minute, is that right? Uh, so I got off the scale, got back on, yep, 207.4. So, in my first week, I lost 8 pounds. Uh, that is insane. <laughs> uh, and I, I know that, like, you know, like, your first week of a diet, you'll have, like, lose water weight and stuff like that. But... I've never been on any diet, healthy or not, where I lost eight pounds in the first week. And the reason I'm really excited about it is because I'm not struggling with the diet at all. Like, it's fine. Like, I'm not like hungry or craving food. Actually, a lot of the times, um, you know, I prep my meals out in advance for how much calories I'm gonna eat during the day every day for the whole week and at the end of the day I'm honestly leaving a meal or two sometimes I'm just not eating it because I'm not hungry you know it's at the end of the day and it's like you know I could eat that but I'm not, I'm not hungry it's like I'm not like oh I'm really hungry and I really wish I could eat that no I'm not like I'm not depriving myself you know it's just I'm not hungry you know um so you know I'm, su I'm super excited about it, but you know, I'm like uh, How this is very awesome, you know, but um, I need to wait till next week to see like Is this a real trend or is it you know just the first week, you know? So I I'm looking forward to the next week because I'm like all right let man like if I could lose eight pounds the first week I have to imagine there's some margin for error, you know, to where I at least lose a pound next week, you know. Like, I feel like I'm doing enough right that, I, you know, I should, you know, losing eight pounds first week, I should at least lose a pound next week, right? Like, uh, you know, so I I'm not going to change my diet at all because obviously I lose eight pounds, I'm doing something right, you know. I'm, I'm in enough of a deficit that I'm losing weight. So diet, not going to change at all. The one thing I would like to... Um, look into is um i i looked i learned recently this week that uh grains um are an inflammatory which means like they make your muscles sore and stuff like that like the same way like milk does milk is also an inflammatory and i cut milk out of my diet um so i'm looking to maybe add like fruit into my diet um but with what I'm doing it was working so well, um, I don't want to change it drastically. So this week I might add like one fruit meal a day to, to my diet and see if that uh, helps any, if it makes me feel any better um, or anything like that, you know? Cause I, I don't want to mess with my weight loss too much. Like it's going so well, I don't want to like change it, to, you know, uh, a lot of things. Cause I don't know like, is it because I mean too many calories or because it is it because I changed it to all fruit like uh, you know I want to slowly change things so if something goes wrong I hate kind of pinpoint like oh well I changed that all right I should probably not change that because now you know that that's that's making it not work um so we'll see um but I definitely would like to add like one fruit meal just to see how I feel and if it makes me feel any better or if it makes me, you know, lose more weight, I don't know. I mean, eight pounds and that, man, <laughs> that'd be crazy if I could keep that going. Um, but yeah, so I'm really excited, you know, because I feel like I'm doing it the right way, you know, this time and it's paying off. Like, I know it's only a week and like I said, why I'm so excited because you know I'm like I can't wait till next week. Next week it's really gonna tell me what, what, what's what. 
Um, so, um, you know, we'll just, I'm just going to do the same thing, you know, um, and we'll, we'll see next week what, what the, what it like, I think it'll be more of a grounded number, you know, um, which I think is going to be kind of hard because after losing like seven pounds your first week to go, you know, or, what was it, seven or eight pounds? I don't know. <laughs> That's a lot. Um, but if I, if, if I lose one pound or two pounds next week, it's going to be a little like disappointing because I'll be, you know, I lost a bunch of weight last week. Um, but, um, the, the way I kind of looked at it is like, man, if I, so in my mind, I wanted to lose, um, a pound a week. Now, if I can lose a pound, that means I'm up like eight weeks. Like I just shaved off two months of my journey, you know? my first week so that's amazing so you know if i could just keep the weight loss going next week oh it, like if i could just save this weight loss like to, to secure it i don't gain any weight next week oh my gosh i'm gonna be so excited because then like i've just pushed like two months forward just just because um so i'm so happy guys i'm so happy i cannot wait to see what i weigh in next week because that'll really tell us how I'm doing. So yeah, I hope you guys are having an awesome day and an awesome week, and I will see you next week.